Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. What's good? Ill Butter featuring. Say your Smirky name. Smirk. <laughs> hey, look, Smirk, Smirk hasn't been on me for, with me for a while. My last show. First of all, much, no, let's rewind. We're going to start with a prayer. Thank you, God, for our ability and our chance and the opportunity to be in search of you. Help us not to just be bumbling fools, speaking for our own self-benefit. I'm not speaking to try to entertain. I really would just like to expand the idea of the search of you, of the discovery of you. And and, um, that's what we're here today for, Ill Butter and... Smirky Smirk. Well, Butter, as y'all know, and thanks for making the last show so successful. Hey, like I was telling you earlier... The last show we had our most listeners. Is that's kind of mm-hmm. hot? Let's the, can I get a round of applause for that? <laughs> anyway, that's a bit much, but appreciate you guys tuning in. If you tuned in, hit a like, man. Make sure you don't leave. Don't leave today without leaving a like, man. That's that's like our food that helps us to keep going. It just lets us know that, you know, gives us an idea of who's tuning in when. I get some analytics, get to to set it up so that it'll be more appealing and, and accessible for you all. But most likely, most importantly, man, I'll keep it 100 with you. When I look at it, and it just it's just my motivation to know that, that I'm reaching out to people. Again, if you're listening to us from a browser, from YouTube, make sure you tune in to the App Store. Go to the App Store, search In Search of God. Uh, download the app. If you're on the iPad, make sure you to the i i uh, iPhone only apps and choose in search of God. I mean, it's important. We want to make sure. Hey, we're going from one listener to a billion. You gotta have lofty go. Hey, you think we can get a billion listeners? No, not a billion. Oh, come on, man! You don't start a show with a no. Not a billion. Why not? That's like more it's people seven, than in the United States. It's seven billion people in the world. I can't mm-hmm. get one seventh of them. Nah, man. See, it, one day remember Smirky Smirk that said that on this day. <laughs> today is what? Today is, is today the seventh. Today is the seventh. It's officially twelve fourteen a.m. So it's the seventh, and it's sixty eight degrees and partly cloudy. <laughs> and, uh, but but uh, remember she said that. She said we won't get we wouldn't get a billion, and you know I think you can do anything if you're humble. And while we're preparing, check us out. Stay humble. Even when you're in trouble, faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Face, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we living in the jungle. Humble, even when you're in trouble, faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Face, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we living in the jungle. Go to the app store, tune in to In Search of God. Put in 
episodes of God. Stay humble, even when you're in trouble. Faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Faith, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we're living in the jungle. It's humble, even when you're in trouble. Faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Faith, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we're living in the jungle. It's humble, even when you're in trouble. Faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Faith, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we're living in the jungle. For those of us that have been following our journey, if you don't know, we're both widows. I told the story many times before, man. I paid for this lady, man. I didn't know where I was going, I didn't know what was happening. I was really in pain. And uh, God put her in my life, man. And a couple yards I went to her. I eventually met her. I looked up at the sky. This girl's not going to say it's not a God. And, you know, I don't think it's not for me to attack anybody. But I'm just telling you, that's a God. <laughs> I'm serious, yo. I'm just telling you, from my personal testimony, there is a God. Stay humble, even when you're in trouble. Faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Face, make a nigga real like humble. Looking for the trouble, but we living in the jungle. Humble, even when you're in trouble. Faith in God, don't give it to the devil. Face, make a nigga real humble. Looking for the trouble, but we living in the jungle. to be in being God. But anyway, we, and listen, heavy, Psalm 82, 6, check that out. But anyway, let's rewind and then we're going to go into the topic. Stephanie and I prayed for, met each other. We just had the, the blessing of being able to come come together in God's name and and get married. Tell them a little bit about that. I mean, if you can't talk about your old marriage, I mean, go ahead. It was great. Um... You know, I thought that it was a, a fairly simple church wedding, but my favorite part was we got to have a dinner the night before, a rehearsal dinner, you know, and sit down and talk to people, you know, because there wasn't, <laughs> the actual wedding was so, you know, busy, do this, do that, you know, go from one thing to the next, and that we didn't really get to spend time with anybody else, so all these people that came out to support us, you know? Right. So... That was my favorite part, the rehearsal dinner. <laughs> yeah, I like that. I really did, for real. Like, the day of the wedding was nice. The ceremony was dope, and I still think about the ceremony because it was, it was still really, really, really special and spiritual, I thought. Uh, but, yeah, the rehearsal dinner was dope. It was really like a time that everybody kind of sat down together, like like she said, and kind of chilled and talked. It's, 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 it's deep because 
for me, it made me miss being around people. It's it's almost like you you eat one dish all the time. No, that's not a that's a bad thing. It's almost like being accustomed to being being away from people so much, and you get a little bit of an experience of being around them. You're like, oh man, it is really cool to be around people. I don't know. Do you have the capacity to be? Around people like that regularly. What does be around people? I, I mean, mean, like be, in, in, the, in midst, the flesh, in the midst of people. Because now we have an ability to be with people all the time with our phones and technology. Yeah, I'm saying but, you talk to people all day long. But I thought Is that that, that being was different. With people, though. you like it was different being a, around them. Though that's what I'm trying to say. Most of my interactions at work, I'm talking to people. But it's something different being in somebody's presence. I mean, come on. Even how... I'll give you an example. As you and I are talking, they're kind of rules for how... So fellowshipping in a way? Not just fellowshipping. Being in the physical presence of other people, <laughs> it, it just gave me a different feeling. It was like... Because people give off energy. Like yeah, that's room. what I was just about to start yeah. talking about. I was like... Yeah, I think that it's definitely possible to feed off other people's energy at all. And, and, you know, um, that kind of goes into what, you know, we're sort of talking about for today. As Tell far them what as, the topic is. Tell them what the topic is. Well, I don't know what the topic is. The, but topic, is who, I was, the topic is who speaks to you. Yeah. And in a way, you have to, you want to take part in their energy, right? Right. That's, you know, otherwise, because I, I I was trying to find some good preachers or pastors or, motiv- I don't even know, I would even say motivational speakers because some of the stuff I was watching was, like, from TED Talks. Right. So, the, and then that would lead into, like, just, like, secular talks. But, um... Well, tell me exactly what you were doing But the point today. is, yeah, I was trying to find, and then... So I listened to You're a lot to of different what? What people, were you to find? just interesting people to listen to, <laughs> I guess. Right. Um, and I listened to, I, I mean, this is like six or seven people, which doesn't sound a lot, but I'm saying if you give them an hour each, right, then that's a lot of that. You know, you know, because I didn't want to. There were some people I don't know, and 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 you know, when I was getting these ideas, looking up ideas, you know, for on the internet and then you get these blurbs about people um who they are where they went to school what they've been you know doing with their life or whatever it is you know then then i you know i guess i was trying to decide oh this person is going to sound like interesting or not based on what the little blurb said about them right so um so anyway you- did you find most it, of the people? Did you find the the persons to be comparable to their blurb? Like, I mean, I know everybody's kind of like even us. Well, we come what, on, I'm I like, mean, this is ultimately, I, nobody. Only one or two people stood out. You know, everybody pretty much blended together. Like, um, you know that they. And I'm not even talking about like their messages or just their ways of talking. I mean, just. You know, I couldn't separate one message from the next by the time I got uh, done with it. Wow. Because they just weren't that, you know, interesting, ultimately. I mean, we were sitting here just And what makes them interesting? Well, they got some sort of energy. And I'm saying it's like, it's an energy that's directed... um, in the message towards, you know, like, because, I mean, most of these men that we're talking... Men? Why are they all men? Anyway, I'm, I'm sorry to cut you off. People are probably getting pissed by now. Go ahead. It's enough, it's enough cutting off of uh, a female speakers going on right now. Hey, I had yeah. to say that one. But anyway, go ahead. Anyway, um, most of these men, their messages were so kind of disjointed that... They were using a lot of personal anecdotes and, you know, little um, humorous devices or something. Like, so what I'm doing. 
I don't know. No, not devices like that. I'm talking.